Hello, this is Easy Target coming back at you with another Diablo 3 video. And this week we got Challenge Rift Week 50. As you can see on screen, we have a Demon Hunter. If you guys haven't subscribed already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I sure would appreciate it. It would really help me out. And if this video helps you, helps you out in any way, please go ahead and hit that thumbs up as well. Uh, bring more people to the channel. Uh, but let's go ahead and jump on into the game and see what we're working with here. Alright, for the skills, we got Multi-Shot. Vault, Companion, Preparation, Evasion Fire, and Vengeance. For the passives, we have Coal of the Week, Ballistics, Ambush, Thrill of the Haunt. And let's move on over to the gear here. We have the Unhallowed es Essence set. Alright, and with this unhallowed set, it gives you 100% uh, increased damage for every point of discipline that you have. So you want to make this, make sure the blue one is up as high as possible. Uh, basically, the only things that's going to be using that is your vault whenever you're going through the levels. Um, and that's basically just maxed out. So whatever he's using here keeps that resource up and nice and high. Uh, so that should be very easy for you to keep up. Uh, you do need a vault around though to keep alive. Uh, so don't be hesitant on using that. Um, and then use it whenever you need to just to get away from some enemies and then just go ahead and use your multi-shot to go ahead and, and kill all your enemies. But I'll go through that step uh, in the next part here. Alright, his weapon uh, gives you extra speed for your multi-shot, so that's 50% faster, so that's 50% more damage, so that's going to be very, very good. The way I'm going to use this uh, set is I'm just going to be vaulting around the level, uh, getting to where I want to go. I'm going to keep my finger on the eva evasive fire. Um, that way it recharges my uh, hatred right here. So whenever I'm going through there, uh, sometimes I'll just go ahead and fire that accidentally and that's recharging my, um, my hatred right there. So uh, keep that in mind. You want to make sure that is up. So whenever you do get to an elite or a big pack that you have plenty of it. So then whenever you do get to there, you just go ahead and use your multi-shot and everything just dies just like that. Uh, you could always activate your companion, just get a little bit more uh, increased damage for 10 seconds. Otherwise, you got 150 damage that he attacks in front of you, just passively. In preparation, if you're getting in a bind and you are using your discipline or your blue one right here, uh, you can use your preparation to go ahead and instantly get 30 of it back. Uh, but I found, like I was saying earlier, that um, you're really not running out of that. The uh, vault right here is the only thing that I found that I'm really using it for and it takes a lot of volts to go ahead and get that down But once you stop for a second and then start shooting the resource comes back almost instantly. So um, That one's gonna be probably not used too often uh, But it is there just in case you need it and then you get your vengeance uh, to activate uh, It's every 90 seconds. So use it for a bigger uh, Elite or your rift guardian, but go ahead and pop that down and it's just gonna give you extra damage uh, just go ahead and pop it down and just use your multi-shot and just go ahead and take out your enemies just like you normally were and then bolting through the level. Uh, but this one should be pretty self-explanatory, pretty straightforward. Um, you will die on this one so you do have to figure out exactly how you're going to move throughout the level so hopefully the maps help you out for that. Uh, but let's go ahead and jump on into the rift and see how to, how to run it. Alright, starting off this rift. Um, Basically all that you want to do is whenever you're going through here is just using your vault just to get through some of the packs and then you just want to, you want to use your multi-shot for your majority of your damage. Uh, that's what's going to kill everything. Uh, whenever you use your vault it uses a little bit of your blue resource which you want to keep up at max so you're doing your max damage. Um, but for the most part just go ahead and vault through as much as you want. Uh, if you need to you can go ahead and use your preparation to get your blue resource back up if you're a little bit low just to get that max damage going. Uh, your companion you can just go ahead and pop whenever you feel like you want a little bit extra damage like whenever you're on an elite or whatnot. Um, I always forget about it or I just usually spam uh, click them but uh, for the most part though I uh, just go ahead volt through everything and use your multi shot. Um, whenever you need that little extra damage for the harder elites so if you're going through and you're spamming your multi shot and the elites aren't going down like almost instantly go ahead and pop your vengeance uh, that's going to give you a lot more damage for your your big elite packs and your rift guardian and whatnot uh, but 
it's it's very fairly simple. You're just going to go through. You can try to get through as fast as you can. Uh, a speed variation of this would probably be you're just using your volts to each elite, and then whenever you get to your elite, go ahead and pop your vengeance to get your resource back, and then just multi-shot uh, the elites down, and hopefully you can get them down uh, really really quickly. Uh, so don't be um, discouraged if you die because you will die um, occasionally if you don't vault out of the way. But if you can um, watch out and uh, guess the attacks of your enemy, you can go ahead and vault out of the way of the big heavy hitters. Um, I feel like it lagged or something right there, so he slammed down on me and just insta-killed me. Uh, but I, I think I died one more time. Um, but for the most part here, it is very, very simple. Uh, you just kind of got to get away from the enemies. If you stay away and you're kind of off by yourself and you're shooting them from a distance it does a little bit more damage uh, you get a little buff if you don't have any enemies around you uh, and you get that buff for like 10 seconds or whatnot uh, but that's about it uh, just go ahead push through here as fast as you can try to get to those elites get these power pylons and the conduit pylons uh, it really helped out on uh, clearing some of that trash so you don't have to worry about using your skills for it um, and yeah, uh, good luck with this one. There's some people out there do, doing some uh, very crazy times. They're like 2 minutes 20 seconds. I think it was the top uh, one whenever I finished this run here. Uh, but people are probably going to get this down into the minutes or maybe 220 is pushing it already. But um, that's just about it. Thank you very much for stopping by. Uh, this is easy and I'm out.